Hi everyone, welcome back here in this new video tutorial. Today we are going to learn how to combine the match formula with VLOOKUP formula to automate the column index number. First of all, let's understand what is given here in the example. This example contains of different fruits name and their quantity sold in different stores like store C, store Y, store B and so on. In the second table, we need to pull the information from the first table by using the VLOOKUP. Here some fruits name are given and some store name are given. And while using VLOOKUP, one of the time taking thing is to define the column index number. So here we will automate the column index number so that we can write one single formula here in the first cell. Then we can simply drag the formula for rest of the other cells. So first of all, I'll show you how does the match formula gets the column index number. So here I am going to use the match function alone. When I type the match function, here it says the match function returns the relative position of an item in an array that matches a specified value. So the role of match function here is to identify the column position of these stores given here. So open the bracket then click on the store A in the lookup value. Then we have to fix this row here. So type the F4 key two times to fix the row. Now comma. In the lookup array, let's take this range from the first table. Press F4 key to fix the range. Now give a comma. And in the match type, let's take exact match. Close the bracket. Now here you see the match function has given the column position of store A here in this data range the store a is is on the eighth column similarly for store b if you drag this formula to right you will see the column position of store b that is 4 column position of store c is 2 and the column position of store d is 9 so the match formula will now automate the column index number inside the vlookup so here now let's combine the both functions. Press is equal to then type B lookup open bracket in the lookup value click on the fruit name that is given here then fix this K column by pressing F4 key three times then give a comma in the table array let's take this first table then press F4 key to fix this array then give a comma now in the column index number combine the match function so type here match open the bracket in the lookup value of the match take this store a then fix this row by pressing f4 key two times then give a comma and here in the lookup array let's select this range now fix this range by pressing f4 key once then give a comma and in the match type take the exact match then close the match function then give a comma then close the B lookup function by taking the exact match option here double click on exact match then close a bracket here now press enter and here you see the quantity sold of orange in store A is calculated now you can go here in the plus button or the fill handle then drag it to right then again go here in the fill handle then drag it to down and here you see all the quantities are now captured from this first table to second table by combining the B lookup formula with match formula. So this is the process of using match formula inside VLOOKUP to automate the column index number and uh, this much for today's video. Thank you very much for watching this. We will again meet on next video tutorial.